off my look by using my Urban Decay Primer all over my eyelid. And then I'm going to use my new palette by BH Cosmetics. It's a neutral palette. I'm going to use the cream shade all over my lid. Then I'm going to go in with this light purple grayish color and I'm going to use this in my crease. It's a very light color so that you're going to need a couple swipes of the color to build up the crease. But this is going to be my first color for my crease. Then I'm going in with a charcoal gray and I'm going to use a light hand to go over that light purple gray and build the crease up. Then I'm going to go in with more of a deep plum purple and I'm going to use a pencil brush to make a V on the outer corner and then drag it into my crease and this is just going to give my crease a little bit more depth. And then I'm using a fluffy brush just to kind of blend everything in but once again I'm using a light hand. Then I'm going to go in with that first color we used which was the creamy vanilla and I'm going to place this in the center of my lid. This is going to add a nice contrast to the whole look. Now my camera got shut off so I am missing the part where I put my lashes on, my eyeliner. I drug the charcoal gray underneath my lash line and then I used the milk pencil by NYX and I used that in my waterline. And then I also just highlighted my face. And here I'm going to add my Jordana lip liner. And this lip liner is in the color Coffee which is my favorite lip liner. And then I'm going to use my NYX Milk Pencil again because I don't have a gray lipstick so I'm using this as a base first right underneath my lip liner. And then on top of that I'm going to go in with um, Wet n Wild Mochalicious and I'm going to use my finger to blend everything in and then I'm going to go back in with the NYX Pencil on top of that and it's going to give it more of a purple gray which I thought was a nice contrast with the eyeshadow. And I'm just going to blend everything in. This is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't. That way you can stay up to date with all my latest videos. And let me know what you would like to see in my future videos in the comment box below. Until next time guys, stay inspired. Bye!